Nikon is preparing to shake up the mirrorless camera market in 2025 and beyond with a striking new lineup that targets every corner of the creative field, from photography to high-end video production. With models like the Nikon ZX, Z6V, Z82, ZFR, ZR, Z9H, and an unprecedented 1000 frames per second camera, Nikon is blending innovation, speed, and cinematic capabilities like never before. Here's a deep dive into what we know and what to expect. The Nikon ZX is generating major buzz as one of the most exciting upcoming mirrorless cameras. Positioned to rival the $6,000 Sony A9 III, the Nikon ZX is expected to launch between $5,500 and $5,800, making it competitively priced for professionals. The highlight is its 20.4MP global shutter sensor developed in partnership with Sony. This sensor captures an entire frame in a single instant, eliminating rolling shutter distortions, ideal for fast-moving subjects like race cars, birds, or athletes. The sensor features a blazing fast 0.4 millisecond readout and allows flash sync speeds up to 112000s. While its resolution is lower than other flagship models, it prioritizes speed and distortion-free imaging, perfect for high-volume shooting. Physically, the ZX inherits the rugged magnesium alloy body from the Z9, along with dual CFX Express Type B card slots. Dual X Speed 7 processors ensure heat management during high speed 30 plus FPS bursts and power a sophisticated AI driven autofocus system that challenges Sony's best. Other upgrades include flicker free shooting under artificial light and enhanced flash sync features, especially useful for studio setups. Though video is a secondary function, it supports 4K resolution, making it capable for hybrid creators. Real world testing is already underway, with over 50 professionals reportedly evaluating prototypes, suggesting a release sometime in 2026. If Nikon delivers on its promises, the ZX could reshape high-speed photography while preserving Nikon's hallmark durability and performance. The Nikon Z8 II aims to build on the strong foundation of the original Z8, which launched in 2023. Known for packing flagship-level power in a compact design, the Z8 was popular among photographers and filmmakers alike. The Z8 II, estimated to cost around $4,500, bridges the price gap between the Z8 and the Z9. Its standout feature is the new Xpeed 7 processor, which boosts image processing and energy efficiency. This upgrade could extend the Z8II's ISO range to 102,400, improve battery life to around 500 shots per charge, and support a 30 frames per second raw burst mode with full autofocus tracking. These changes not only rival the Canon R5 but also cater to action photographers needing precision and speed. Video performance takes a leap as well. The Z8 II is rumored to support 8K 60p internal recording in 12-bit NRAW and ProRes RAW, along with oversampled 4K to 120p for detailed slow-motion footage. Improvements in thermal management, possibly graphene-based, are expected to solve overheating issues that plagued the original Z8. Autofocus gets a boost too, with a new AI-driven 3D Tracking Plus system that excels in subject recognition and eye detection, whether you're capturing portraits or wildlife. The Nikon ZFR is a rumored successor to the ZF, blending vintage aesthetics with modern features. While its existence is still unconfirmed and possibly fabricated, it has stirred up significant interest. Early leaks suggest a 60MP full-frame sensor, potentially competing with Sony's A7R V and Canon's R5, and even whispers of 16-bit RAW recording, a spec usually reserved for medium-format systems. Other rumored features include 8K video and a high-resolution electronic viewfinder. However, questions remain. The ZFR's compact, retro body might struggle with heat dissipation, especially during high-resolution or video capture. The price is expected to fall between $3,000 and $4,000, placing it in a professional market segment. Despite skepticism, Nikon's success with previous retro-styled cameras keeps the ZFR within the realm of possibility. If real, it would offer high-res imaging in a stylish, throwback form factor.
the Nikon ZR is Nikon's boldest hybrid concept yet. Expected in late 2025 and priced around $4,500, this camera is poised to challenge the Sony FX3 and even Red's Komodo X. At its core, the ZI uses the same 24.5 MP partially stacked sensor as the Z6 III, but it's built with cinema in mind. Its big headline is internal 6K red code RAW recording, a first in this category, alongside support for NRAW, Apple ProRes, and real-time LUTs. Built-in color grading and red color science bring high-end filmmaking tools to indie creators. Design-wise, the ZR is expected to skip the EVF in favor of a modular, rig-friendly shape similar to the FX3. Expect a large articulating screen, advanced heat management, and multiple mounting options. It will be compatible with Z-mount and possibly PL-mount lenses via an adapter. If it delivers, the ZR could become the go-to tool for creators wanting red-level quality without the cost or complexity. The Nikon Z6V, also referred to as the Z63 Cinema Edition, further emphasizes Nikon's shift towards serious hybrid filmmaking. Expected by late 2025, the Z6V strips away the EVF for a compact, video-optimized form factor, featuring tally lights, a dedicated ISO dial, and multiple heat vents. Internally, it houses the same 24.5 MP partially stacked CMOS sensor from the Z6 III, offering full with 6K 60p recording, 20 frames per second RAW stills, and internal red code RAW, again a standout feature in this class. It also supports NRAW, ProRes, and 16-bit color depth, providing extensive post-production flexibility. Features like DCI for K, anamorphic lens support, shutter angle control, and internal ND filters make the Z6V a true filmmaker's tool. Additional perks include gyroscopic stabilization, compatible with Catalyst Browse, 32-bit float audio recording, dual USB-C ports for SSDs, and wireless features like Wi-Fi 6E and camera-to-cloud support. At $3,499, it aims to outperform the Canon R5C and Sony FX3, especially with red cinematic pipeline and internal ND filters, a rare feature in this segment. For professional action photographers, the Nikon Z9H is one of the most anticipated high-speed mirrorless cameras in development. Rumored to feature a next-generation global shutter sensor with extremely fast readout, the Z9H could change the game for sports, wildlife, and flash-heavy environments. Flash sync speeds may reach up to 1.12.000s, and the camera will likely include dual Xpeed 7 processors for high-speed processing. The Z9H isn't focused on resolution but on speed and reliability, aiming to outperform Canon's R1 and Sony's A9 III. Design leaks hint at a slightly smaller body than the Z9, a new function dial, and a possibly enhanced EVF with high refresh rates for better subject tracking. A release in early 2026 is expected, though pricing remains unknown. It's safe to assume this will be a premium tool for elite professionals. Perhaps the most futuristic innovation comes in the form of Nikon's new stacked CMOS sensor capable of 4K video at a staggering 1000 frames per second. This technology opens doors previously only accessible with niche, expensive systems like the Phantom Flex. Beyond speed, this 1-inch square sensor offers 110 dB dynamic range at 1000 frames per second and stretches to 134 dB at 60 frames per second. Its dual-layer design allows real-time exposure adjustments for highlight and shadow retention. Framed at 25.4 by 25.4 mm, the square format makes it versatile for both horizontal and vertical content, ideal for social media or immersive VR environments. The sensor's potential applications span far beyond traditional mirrorless cameras. Whether in high-speed action recording, scientific imaging, or 360 degrees video, it represents a quantum leap in sensor technology. Real-world deployment will depend on how Nikon addresses challenges like heat dissipation and data transfer, but the direction is clear, Nikon is aggressively innovating. Nikon's upcoming lineup reflects a company not just reacting to the market, but actively shaping it. From the lightning-fast Nikon ZX to the red-powered ZR and Z6V, 
and even rumors of a retro powerhouse in the ZFR, Nikon is aiming to serve professionals, hybrid creators, and innovators alike. If the company delivers on these ambitious promises, 2025 and beyond could mark a new golden era for Nikon in both photography and filmmaking.